Vale side is drawn from nine clubs and there's plenty of first-class experience. Ewan Jones in the back row plays for Genetli and Liverpool St. Helens supply two forwards in Andy Edwards and Wayne Pugh. Stuart Roy, who's played for Cardiff this season, is the only player in the full Welsh squad. Fullback, scrum half and hooker, three crucial positions come from the Pusheli club, while Dullan Jones and Nigel Hollifield are two of Wrexham's three representatives. The halfbacks are not related. The side is captained by scrum half Gary Williams. Western Samoa have made seven changes from the team which just pipped Newbridge 16-15 on Saturday, four of them behind the scrum. Fullback Tupo makes his first appearance, as does Lino on the wing and Young in the center. The 20-year-old Patea is also the new fly half. The two new men in the forwards are second row Rupina and Mano on the flank. And there's no rest for Lalani Coco, who captains the side for the third match in a row. So it's the new fly half, Patea, who kicks off for Western Samoa this third match of their tour of Wales and Ireland. And a confidence certainly in the camp after their win against Newbridge. But the first penalty given against the Western Samoans by the referee for this afternoon, Mr. Stephen Griffiths uh, from Birmingham of the Rugby Football Union. Patea Patea, that's his name, a 20-year-old student with a dropout. That's a useful restart. Not quite taken by Stuart Roy. Now it's Darrell Williams with the breakthrough. Inside to Mano. Good work by Western Samoa. Tumalatai with a pickup. The drive on by the Samoans. But they lose possession. Ewan Jones, very quick. Half charge down. Well, the knock on by North Wales. And it'll be a scrummage to Western Samoa. Vincent on the narrow side. Lots of uh, mobility, lots of uh, fluidity about Western Samoa, but that's Wayne Pugh. And now Stuart Roy, trying to tidy up for North Wales. Pugh breaks on the narrow side. Gary Williams, tackled by his opposite number, Vincent. Beautiful tackle, that. Well, the ball is there for the asking. Patea. Nicely done by Phineas, Phineas Young. Just outside the Western Samoan 22, Fatia Lofa comes away with it. Patea. Oh, Western Samoa looking a little adventurous in the early parts. Patea. Outside is 22, and Paul Martin watches the ball go into touch. Well, that'll do his confidence a lot of good, the 20-year-old, in his first appearance on tour. And Seppi almost got a hand to it, Mano going down for it. Tidied up at the back by Tim Davis of Wrexham. Nigel Hollifield, Mark Ferguson, and now Dylan Jones. Dylan Jones is fast. Mark Ferguson looking back inside. Dylan Jones trying to stay on his feet. Ewan Jones is there, but great work by North Wales. The first touch of the three quarters. Well, it started from uh, lovely handling and uh, the service from Alan Williams at fly half. And just look how the backs really get their act together. The passing is good and Dylan Jones is very fast. The pressure on the Western Samoan scrum. Indeed, it's going backwards. Patea can't keep hold of it. Phineas Young, he's in dangerous territory there. Now then, a chance here perhaps for North Wales. Ian Stutt going forward, Stuart Roy Wayne Pugh with the rip outside to Nigel Hollifield, Paul Martin's in the line Yolo Abdavid and uh, Tupo of uh, Samoa tidies up One, three, two. Stutt with the throw. Darrell Williams steals it again. The referee spotting an infringement and that'll be a free kick to North Wales. Gary Williams out to Alan Williams. The drop goal attempt. Oh, it's the crossbar. Tupo. 
Well, North Wales almost waiting for something to happen, but Tupo taking his time. And uh, we might well have seen the follow-up there by the North Wales players. So the put-in by Vincent, but uh, a chance perhaps for North Wales. And uh, foot up against Tumalatai. The professor, as he's uh, been nicknamed on this current tour. We will see the drop goal attempt. Straight out, though, to Ewan Jones. There's a move on here on the right. Ewan Jones looking back inside. Gary Joe, Gary Williams, Alan Williams, Nigel Hollifield, Paul Martin in the line. It's going a little bit sideways. Vili Alalatour now tries to come away from the 22. To Isse. Got the man outside him. Sepe does the tidying up. The North Wales hanging in there. Still inside the Western Samoan 22. Oh, looks a little bit at a slow pace, but still Western Samoa try to come away. And Canetti decides that uh, there's no room for heroes at this stage. So the first shortened line-out of this first half, and that's uh, quite a novel move. Ian Stutt almost going over, but uh, Seppi is there to defend. Vincent. Vincent, scrum half. Took a bump there. Shortened line out again. Wayne Pugh from the Liverpool St. Helens Club wearing five. Stuart Roy at the back wearing four. Nicely tapped back. Good move this by North Wales. Ewan Jones been in the action a lot in this first half. Alan Williams. Well, the tackle by Young. And North Wales trying to come away with it. Gary Williams. Good searching kick by the scrum half. Well, some of the movements have been a little bit on the slow side, and that'll be good for the forwards. That's the big Rupina. Not so big, actually, for the lock position he's playing. He's partnering Daryl Williams. And Vili Alalatoa tried to tap it back. It's tied it at the back by Tim Davis. So that slightly larger Samoan pack goes backwards, but uh, a chance here for Canetti. Canetti looking outside him. Tupo is there. Good work this by Samoa. That's Lino. And Lolani going up to the line. Uh, the Taurus have scored. The try given. Vincent is the scorer. Uh, that was interesting. He's been a bit casual with some of his uh, punt kicking this afternoon, but uh, a little bit too casual there with the conversion. Patea. Straight to David Cook for North Wales. Wayne Pugh. Now then, Gary Williams, Alan Williams. The missed pass straight to Hollifield. Paul Martin's in the line. Well, he had Iolo Abdavid outside him, but uh, preferred the chip. Cleaned up by 2SA for the Samoans. And the penalty against Western Samoa. Penalising 2SA number seven. Well, the quick one taken by Gary Williams. Wayne Pugh charging for the line. Ian Stutt goes on with it, lays the ball back. Ewan Jones going for the line and the referee says the ball won't come up from there Ewan Jones who uh, plays for St. Ashley this season formerly of the Wrexham club So a great chance here now then for North Wales, trailing by four points to nil. And they're as close as that to the Western Samoan try line. And it looked as if there might have been a punch thrown on that far side. The referee is uh, 
going, certainly going to have a word with one of the Western Samoans. That's Vincent, the scrum half, and the penalty against him. Gary Williams then, to Wayne Pugh. Well, there really isn't a lot of room on that far side, but quick ball comes back. Ewan Jones, and almost finding a gap through there, Gary Williams goes on the blind side. No room through for Andy Edwards, and into touch they go. Crucial th throw then for Stan Tumalatai. Right on their own goal line for the Samoans. Darrell Williams got a hand to it, but it's Wayne Pugh. Now the ball on by North Wales. David Cook trying to rip it. Comes back. Gary Williams, desperate defence by Samoa. And the knock on. And uh, the scrummage. Gary Williams and the pickup by Tim Davis. Now then Williams on the narrow side. Dylan Jones outside him. Back inside to Paul Martin. Ewan Jones and David Cook. This is a good move by North Wales. Alan Williams, Mark Ferguson, Martin's in the line. Hollifield, Yolo Abdavid going for the corner. And that's great cover defence by Lolani, but uh, Abdavid, great uh, work by him on the left wing. Vincent eager to get on with it and eager to get it away. Patea has got a two-man overlap. Tupo's in the line. Lots of pace by Tupo over the halfway line. Lolani, Lolani going for the line, stretching his legs, and he's going to make it. Lolani scores a great try for Western Samoa. Great try for the captain. There's the captain, Lolani, and look how Lolani goes. He's big, he's strong, going for the corner, and it's Dylan Jones coming across who almost tackles him, but that is a very fine try for the Samoan captain. Vincent out to Patea. A little bit adventurous this by the Samoans. Their confidence uh, certainly high after that last try. But it's North Wales, a rob possession again. David Cook. Not looking outside him, now he does. Gary Williams, the long pass out to Alan Williams. Two men outside him, Paul Martin. Looks back inside, David Cook. That'll be a knock on, the referee quite right to allow advantage. Tumalatai on the narrow side. He's enjoying a run. But suddenly the Samoans looking adventurous, there's confidence there. Gary Williams and uh, a slight knock on. And the substitute uh, for Ewan Jones is Gwilym James. Injury time now being played. Wayne Pugh. Tap back by Sepe. Billy Alalatoa, very mobile for a prop. Fatia Lofa, great work by the Samoan props. This is really great stuff by the Samoans. Uh, Darrell Williams, the pass out to Sepe. And Canetti scores for Samoa. The third try in this, the first half. And... Uh, they extend their lead to 12 points. Patea with the conversion attempt. It's a good one. The two extra points. And the half-time score, 14 points to nil. Three tries scored by Western Samoa, who certainly looked a very improved out outfit in this first half. The second half gets under the underway. And a slight wind advantage for North Wales in this second half. A slight juggle by Alan Williams. That might have been a late tackle. The referee certainly had a look at it. But play allowed to carry on. Alan Williams. The long pass out to Yalo Abdavid. Running into crunching tackles. Willem James, the replacement. And uh, a penalty against Western Samoa for offside and this will be a chance to put the first points on the board for North Wales <laughs> uh, 
And three points, and the first points to North Wales, who now trail by 14 points to three, and we've had just one minute of the second half. Darrell Williams, again, getting a hand to it. Tidied up by Seppi. Well, was there a knock-on? No, the referee is allowing play to carry on. Lalani in the line. This is the new winger, Lino. Western Samoan forwards, hungry to get this ball back. But they're not going to get it back, but the penalty has been given against North Wales for playing the ball with the hand. Chance then for Patea to extend the lead for the tourists. A kick of about 21 meters. Struck it well, and it's there. Samoans lead now by 17 points to three. Good shove that by North Wales. Well, they certainly are keeping their act together, even though they're trailing. Gary Williams with the steal. Dave Cook. Good tackle by Patea. Now much more urgency by North Wales. Gary Williams perhaps just can't get out of there. Wayne Pugh with the pickup. Can he do the scrum half pass? He can. Alan Williams, Mark Ferguson. Ferguson, men outside him. Coming back inside, Willem James. North Wales still can't find a way through, but the penalty against Western Samoa for offside. Alan Williams for North Wales, just inside the Samoans, 22, struck it well. And uh, gradually North Wales coming back. 17 points to six now. A pick up by Tim Davis, Gary Williams, Alan Williams, Hollyfield, back inside Dylan Jones. Great tackle by Patea. The Samoans fly half. And all those yellow jerseys going in right over the top and the penalty against North Wales. hasn't found touch it's found Dylan Jones and Dylan Jones really eager to get on with it and get back into the game Mark Ferguson Hollifield well Abdavid was outside him but uh, if the kick goes into touch it's certainly going to put North Wales back on the attack but now look who the man who was covering that is quite remarkable Vili Alalatoa there he is what a game he's had this afternoon Attacking down on this open side, David Cook. Trying to keep Vincent out of the way of scrum half, Gary Williams, neatly done. Alan Williams, Yolo Abdavid in the line. This is going to be a great try for North Wales. A super try by Yolo Abdavid. And the conversion is good by Alan Williams. Six more points. And the gap is now just five points as Western Samoa lead by 17 points to 12. Tuese, the flanker, wearing seven, and Sepe at the back, number eight. But that's uh, number six, Mano. And now Fatialofa comes away with it. What a big man. Look at this charge on now, Darrell Williams. Just a few meters from the North Wales goal line. In frustration on the part of Vincent the scrum half, but the scrimmage has been given. A good shove again by North Wales, and once again the scrimmage is wheeled, but Mano with a pick up on the far side. And penalty against North Wales. Pointing to the man on the ground, that's Gwillem James, finding himself on the wrong side of the ball. And this could well be another three points for the Samoans. 
Patea taking his time. These three points are important. Just five points between the two sides. Just inside the North Wales 22. Oh, he stroked it nicely. And the lead is extended now by eight points. Sepe with the pickup. Vincent Lalani after it. And that's put uh, Samoa back on the attack. Encouragement for his team. Fatia Lofa, 18 stone from Auckland. Taken by Daryl Williams in the middle. Well, the aspect, uh, one of the aspects of the Samoans which has really improved is the forward play, especially in the line-out. Lovely work in the backs. The long pass out to Lino. Lino, men outside him. Anateria, Anateria is going to score here. Lovely try for Western Samoa. Well, it came from the line-out, and Darrell Williams has done such fantastic work for the tourists this afternoon. Great take by him. The long pass out to Patea. Patea gets his backs moving. Now, just look at the passing in midfield. They all are hungry for the ball. They want to go forward. It's Anna Terea who finally gets it. Anna Terea looking outside, and it's an easy trot in for him. The fourth try for Western Samoa. And it's just the referee's optional time. Vincent has a look that may well go straight in no Paul Martin's there long pass out to Hollyfield it's all across field at the moment no gaps there straight back to Martin North Wales going backwards <laughs> and beautifully done by Tuese but uh, North Wales still coming back Willem James Over two minutes now of injury time played. And the big shove by Samoa. Lalani in the standoff position. He's very strong. Oh, Filippo almost took the pass off his hip. That could well have been a try. Seconds ticking away now as Gary Williams looks over the scrummage, has a go himself, tackled by Mano, back inside to David Cook, up to the halfway line. Pew with a pickup, but oh, that's the final whistle, and Western Samoa have won by 24 points to 12, and uh, a much more convincing display by the tourists, scoring four tries, showing lots of ideas, especially in the three quarters, and a much more urgent display by the forwards. They picked up a couple of injuries this afternoon, but all, all in all, it looks far more encouraging as they prepare now for their fourth match against Bridgend on Saturday at the Brewery Field.